Swiss pilot Raphael Domjan and his crew set a new altitude record for solar-powered aircraft. We can get so much energy coming from the sun. Everywhere on this planet you can find sun. It's really the, the future of our mankind. You need a lot of energy to go that high. On that day, the weather was really nice and the wind was really, really calm. I have the time to make some calculation in my mind. Okay, it looks like it's good, 31, 32,000 feet. So I was quite confident. Domjan threaded through the clouds, danced around glaciers, and balanced every watt of power. You need to take care of the energy. You need to fly really at the good speed with the good power to always stay at the optimum to charge the battery just with the sun. So you have to put the plane on the tarmac just with the sun, and for this you need one and a half days to recharge completely the batteries. This flight was the ultimate dare to gravity, to the limits of technology, and to the future of clean aviation. To go that high just with the power of the sun, I fly with an airliner. At the same altitude I was able to see it was a Lufthansa flight, and I was not that far away of, of them, and that was really amazing. The journey only inspired him to climb even higher. So next, it will be the stratosphere. So now we have to work to optimize the plane, to change the batteries, to try to reach the stratosphere. I think uh, now the plane can fly at 60,000 feet, more or less. What is missing is the energy to go there. My job is to protect uh, our climate, to protect the biosphere. And there is not so many people doing this. What we can achieve with solar energy and how important it is to protect our uh, atmosphere. For me, this, this is an experience that is really amazing.